You may remember a little while ago I did a video on air rifles. Some people were asking whether I have or shoot air rifles. Of course, air rifles are so useful and so easy to shoot. And then I received a message from Hans Wurst, and I think in Germany, if I'm remember, remembering correctly, and he told me about uh, two rifles uh, available in the US. Uh, these rifles, Hanel 310s. And um, so he even gave me the link. So I contacted the company and, and uh, Hans, here they are. And you're 100% correct. So on the prior video, we looked at rifles like Slavia's and um, I think we looked at maybe some Webley's and, and, and some others. But I have to say, these handles are just unbelievable. Um, this one, I can't remember what I paid, but it was exactly what you sent. And I'll just walk the viewers, all of you, through how this thing works. Apparently, this was designed by Hugo Schmeiser, and you probably recognize that name. That's not an insignificant name. So uh, they showed up, and this is the magazine. This is a six shot magazine. And you load these typical BBs, same BBs you put in your Red Rider. I think I did, a, oops, I think I did a Christmas video some years ago with this, with, uh, with, which all, with the Red Rider, and it uses those BBs. So you put them in here, then it, it goes in here just like that and it doesn't look like it's secure but it is and then you work the action this is the most fantastic thing ever uh, Hans you can't imagine how much fun I've had with this with this BB gun uh, because it's not really a BB gun it's it's accurate and it's powerful so I you you operate it by pulling back here whoops you can see the pressure that that it takes to load it now it's a loaded gun, you close and you fire. So I have to be careful with this and there's no way to unload it, which is why they're not welcome at some ranges. Uh, this one was even cheaper. I paid the guy the same prices that you sent me, whatever it was, this was 75 or whatever, doesn't matter. And uh, because it's somebody sanded the stock and there was a magazine missing. Oh, there's the magazine. This magazine, was in this gun and that gun had no magazine so then I bought two new magazines which fit either one so in short uh, why am I making this video because if you can find these and if if anybody out there is entrepreneurial somebody needs to make these again this is a repeating um, BB gun that is so much fun to shoot and has so much power relative to the effort you have to make to cock it. I couldn't believe it. And I had some foam blocks out here, which in the meantime, I've stored away. But I used one foam block and I thought that'll stop the BBs for sure because there can't be that much power in this Model 310. I put a piece of plywood on the other side of the foam block just to be safe and the BB went right through the first thick, dense foam block, uh, 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 giving you an idea of the amount of power from this 310. So, um, in short, this is a tremendous value, and if you can find them, this one was like new, and I paid a hundred some dollars thanks to Hans. Uh, so yeah, this was a great tip, and easily the most fun and most useful this would this 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 Hanel 310 would have no problem uh, dealing with my starling problems and you can see how he designed them i probably they were used as trainers i guess i've got them the wrong way around for filming but it doesn't matter and um yeah made in germany it's a uh, it's it's fantastic i i i was uh, excited to get them they arrived in no time. Nobody seems interested in them. Nobody knows about them. But thanks to you, Hans, I learned about them. And this was a revelation. Fantastic air rifle.
and uh, I can't imagine a more fun air rifle for uh, for a young person who, who who expresses an interest in uh, in in doing some shooting. So thanks again, and I mean it, it even looks decent. You can see that this was not this is not a stupid plastic design. That it's got a beechwood stock. It's got a bolt handle. You kind of feel like you're using a Mauser 98 and yet you're just using an, an air rifle but it's not a toy it's uh, it's excellent in every way so thanks again Hans and um, please everybody when you know something that I don't know just write me and I'll do my best to get whatever it is you know and uh, make a video thanks again I will see you next time okay, bye bye